Hello. Good morning. Hey, good morning, Professor. How are you? Uh, sorry, sorry. I'm late for a couple of minutes. No, you're all good. So, any question? I, I had a few questions for you. So, yes. Yes. Um, on week 14, um, when we are doing the uh, expression syntax tree, um, when we build the tree, um, are yes. we like, are we coding the nodes on where they are or how are we exactly are we building the tree? I guess is my question. Building the tree, you use the list or use a table should be fine as long as it's a tree. Okay, so, so, so there is no need that you actually need to build a physical node or something. Okay, so we wouldn't do like... In fact, the node you can actually use a, a so-called... Uh, so a node can be something that is a list, right? Deb array, something like that. And you're simple in the middle, something like that. Or you put your uh, a list simple and deb and right. Okay, would it would it be yeah. wrong if I did like right dot left? Equals... Not not saying it's wrong. Not saying it's wrong. As long as you construct a tree, okay, and and you can evaluate the uh, evaluate the tree. There's no limitation of what the tree should be. Okay, okay. Perfect. I just want and, clarification. The whole thing is that as long as you can evaluate the tree, that should be fine. That's an exercise of how okay. you can manage the tree and then uh, perform operation. I mean. Otherwise, gotcha. there's no such a thing as right or wrong on the data structure. The choice of the data structure is your own. So, so we don't uh, need to limit you on whether this should be used or that should be used. There's okay. no such thing like that, yeah. Cool, okay. I just wanted to make sure the way I was building it wasn't gonna be right or wrong in any case. No, um, no, 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 okay. Cool. Um, as, long as, as long as you can read in the infix expression, comparative post -speak, Expression convert it to a tree. That's it. Okay. And then if you can do evaluation, evaluate that tree to get a result. Then okay. Okay, cool. Um my other question was about week 16, because I, I started taking a look at that one. Mm -hmm. Um I noticed that it was to basically write a chatbot. Um and my question to you was my original term proposal was I was going to write a chatbot. So just to make sure that I'm not basically copying week 16's assignment, I've decided to change my term project. It's um, okay. It's okay. Yeah. Week 16, you can just give a week or small version. Okay. Yeah. Just just small and, revision. And yeah. No, I mean you just put put a small. Small version on the which team homework is fine. Your plan project, I'm expecting it to be bigger, right? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, cool. So not completely having to change it. Okay, perfect. Yeah. yeah. Um, and then still holding on to week 16. Um in my in my um like research of you know, kind of looking into my term project, I noticed people were using like JSON files to um kind of train the AI, is that kind of something you're looking for with week 16 as well? No. Okay. Week 16 is a, just you write something for Q and A, that's it. If you can do more, you do more. There's no uh, minimum, this should be, no. We don't okay. say that, right? We don't say that in the problem description, we don't. Okay. I just yeah. want to make sure because when I was researching for my term project, I saw mm. people that they were explaining it and they were like, oh, you need a JSON file. So I want to make sure that that wasn't the case for week 16. It's, it's, we think that the term project are separate. So okay. we, we look at it totally separate. Okay. Yes. Um, cool. That was all the questions I had for this week. Yeah, no problem. No problem. Right. Yeah. Thank you Welcome. so much. All right. Have a great week. Yeah. Yeah. No problem. I'll stay here for longer. Okay, we are almost uh, twelve thirty now, central time. Uh, I do see one student show up today. So, uh, if you have any question, you can still contact me. Okay. Uh, thank you. Bye now. <laughs>